Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are going to be playing Rise of the Tomb Raider's new DLC. I think it's Baba Yaga, the Temple of the Witch. Uh, and so I was going to play the This War of Mine, the Little Ones, but it has disappeared from the Xbox One store. And I can't buy a copy of it locally, uh, so I'm not ordering it online. I'll just wait till it appears back at the store, or just not do it at all, I guess. Um, but we're going to be playing this new DLC. It came out on Tuesday. I would have done it then, but I wanted to kind of start this Friday. I have some time to record, uh, and I wanted to, you know, kind of start back my channel today, um, which fit for perfectly with this War of Mine, the Little Ones being released, but alas, it is gone, so we're going to be playing this. If it will ever load. Um... But I'm also going to be playing through some other games. I'm waiting for the Witcher 3 DLC uh, before I do kind of this comprehensive playthrough of it. Uh, and then going to be going back and playing Fallout 4. It sounds like someone just broke into my house. I don't know if you guys could hear that. Um, I lost my train of time. Oh, I'm going to be doing Fallout, and I'm doing all the cool games that came out in the fall, or at least most of them that I didn't let's play because I was busy with college. And I needed a break from YouTube after doing it for like five years. Um, but we are back. Um, I started up here instead of at the location because there's some dialogue that plays. Uh, you also get this whiteout jacket that I'm... You either get it for completing the game or you get it from the DLC. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but let's go ahead and fast travel. You do not want to fast travel to this location. This base... Oh my gosh, it's so hard to name. Okay, this base camp right here. Uh, because it's underground and it's not where you need to be. I traveled to this one, and this is the one that worked well. So go ahead and travel to the logging camp. And let's go ahead and get into this. I put the overlay on, the broadcaster overlay. I know I'm not broadcasting, but I'm recording. And it's not a bad-looking overlay either. Uh, it lets you know what place I'm in. Um, and then it lets you know, I guess, my gamer tag. That really doesn't help you guys in any way. I don't know why that's up there. Uh, but I be believe it adds some other stuff on the bottom. I can't actually see it on my TV. I can see it on the preview uh, screen, and I can see that it looks fine and all that. But my TV, for some reason, is zoomed just like a little bit. It cuts off just a little bit at the top, right, and left, and the bottom of the screen. The bottom isn't as bad, and the right isn't. I don't know why. It's an old TV. I got it when I was younger, um, and it, it just has worked really well. It's easy to transport. It's easier to do all this stuff. It's about the easiest 32-inch to move around that you can find, uh, which is nice because I can take it places. Uh, if we have, like, all-night Xbox parties or whatever at my friend's house, um, it's easy to transport. It was easy to tr bring back and forth from college, all that different stuff. So I love this TV. Going in. Overwatch, we have contact with the native in the old sawmill. We've wounded her, but it looks like they set traps around the perimeter. I've got one casualty so far. Doing a sweep. Alright, so the sawmill is right there, so let's go ahead and get over there. I'm going to have to get reused to the controls in this game because I haven't played it in forever, and it's different than the games I have been playing. Alright. Do not let the target slip away. We need to know why they were following Bravo Team. Bravo right. hasn't run into any more resistance along the way, but find the native. We need to get some answers. This guy needs to go away. No, walk away. I'm assuming I'm supposed to kill him. Walk away. No, walk away. Go, go away. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, you know what? We're under attack! Right there! Where's the other guy? Oh crap, not what I wanted to do! You know what? No, go down, go down, go down. Get clear! Where is he? There he is. Okay, I thought I would I, I didn't think that grenade would blow up so quickly. Now where is he? I missed. I missed again trying to quick fire. There. Headshot. Okay. Now that they're dead. If there's someone in here, it's safe. You can come out now. Yeah, they're not coming out. Okay, where? Got to be hiding in here somewhere. Maybe there's a trail. 
Nothing, but definitely big enough to hide in. <sighs> Did I miss one of these? Oh, Stop. okay. No closer. I'm not with Trinity. My name is Lara, and your gun isn't loaded. I can see the cylinder is empty. The firing pin never worked anyway. You're hurt. I just need to sit down for a moment. Lara, was it? I'm Nadia. I could use your help. I can see that. Yeah, I can see. Since you're hiding in a stupid weapons what closet. Can I do? My grandfather snuck out of the village in the night. I think he's headed for the Wicked Vale, where the witch Baba Yaga lives. I was trying to catch up with him when the invaders caught me. Before I was born, the witch killed my grandmother. Grandpa always talked about revenge, but I never thought he'd actually go through with it. There isn't much time, and I'm in no condition to go myself. We have to find him. Obviously accept them. Oh, mission reward, new outfit and bow. I'll head out that way and see if I can pick up his trail. <sighs> Thank you. The path to the Vale is through the cave to the east of here. All right, let's go find. I thought Baba Yaga was going to be. Oh, is it right here? I thought Baba Yaga was going to be a place, and then the Temple of the Witch was going to be like an area within Baba Yaga. But I guess Baba Yaga is a person. Oh, these stupid wolves. I should probably spend, I, I saw I had like one skill point available, I probably should have spent that while I had the time. Though I think I have essentially all the skills I want, now where? Okay, I don't think this is it. I think I'm in the wrong spot. Okay. Alright, so I came in here and had to kill wolves for nothing. We have a combat knife, why do we cut them open with the arrow? Alright, where is this place? Oh, I think it's... Okay. It gives you kind of a... Depth issue of where it is, because it, yeah, it's behind. Okay. Simple enough. Now, where is it from here? Oh, right here. Was this cave? I don't think this cave... I think this is a new cave. I don't think it's... I don't think this was here before. Oh, no, I think it is. It, it was here before. Is there, I think there was a tomb here. Yeah, I think there was a tomb here. Or this... Because I, I wouldn't assume they just leave the door open like that. It makes no sense. But I could be wrong. Alright. Laura, I found a radio on one of the invaders you killed. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. I can monitor the invaders' frequencies from here while I patch myself up. I'll let you know if I hear anything useful. Alright, so she has the... She know what, uh, what frequency we're on. Let's see here, anything special? No. Alright, let's go ahead and spend the skill point that I have. Obviously just got it from beating the game. Um, I had to master the brawler ability because I had to get that achievement. Uh... Let's see here. Arrow Climber. Body Trap Specialist. Hollow Point. I'll just make Hollow Point Bullets. It really doesn't matter to me. Uh, pretty much set with what I want. I gotta figure out how to change everything here. Okay, so here's this rifle. What more can you tell me about the Wicked Veil, Nadia? My people stay far away from that place. They have for centuries. When the Soviets were here, they tried to build an outpost in the Veil. But they angered Baba Yaga, and she drove them all mad. Grandpa told me all about her. She lives in a magic house that can walk with the legs of a bird. Do you believe all that? The house with the bird legs? I trust Grandpa. He was in the Gulag when the Soviets took my grandmother into the Vale to help them study the ruins. The witch killed her, and he's never forgotten that. But a witch straight out of a Russian folktale? It sounds unlikely. Just be careful. Something is in the veil. Nothing good happens in that place. Alright, so it sounds like... And I do rec recognize this area, so we have been here before. Um, Shit. Steady. Sounds like this... What is up with Rise of the Tomb Raider and having... Or Tomb Raider, these new Tomb Raider games and having supernatural crap? 
Why can't I just go... No, I don't want to jump. There we go. Is it really... Wait, where am I going? Laura, hang on. I'm picking up a transmission. You need to hear this. Well, that didn't sound good. Did you hear that? That was the witch. Something's definitely happening out there. Whatever it is, we'll get to the bottom of it. So the witch is not just the witch is not just a myth, okay? Well, we knew that wasn't going to be the case, but I mean it's not like uh we know they're not going to keep it a mystery, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Okay, is there something here? Do I just make this incredible leap of faith? I don't think I can make that, but okay, I'll try it. But I was I was wondering if they would try to make this witch a mystery. Oh yeah, I forgot. Okay. Well, it's a good thing I misclicked X. <laughs> because I forgot that we had that ability. A small camp here. Sounds like Grandpa made it that far at least. You're almost into the veil. But I was wondering if they would keep this witch a mystery, or if they would, um, if they would let us know who she, who she is, I guess, or know that she's actually a thing and not, I don't know what I'm trying to say. But let us know at least that she's, or what she is, or kind of how she works, and how powerful she is. Nadia. I think I found your wicked veil. I don't know if it's Baba Yaga, but there's something out here. Be careful. This is her land. Okay, what is down here? Okay, it's just kind of an alcove. I don't think I can get back there at this moment. Alright, let's go ahead and hit up this camp. This base camp. Go ahead and head out. See if we can find this girl's grandpa. Well, we'll start out with Initial this. Initial contact was made with the elderly native male at 0700. At first, we believed he was participating in an assault on the facility, but he proceeded away and through an unmapped canyon. We received authorization to pursue at a distance, and already we've encountered ruins and other promising signs. We're trying to keep calm out here, but this looks like a big find. That discovery bonus is as good as ours. All right, so I wish I wish you had the time, because then I could figure out how far behind I am since it was 0700. <coughs> There's some sort of pollen drifting in here. Flowers. <coughs> what did you say? What did you say? I, I, I can't understand you. Something's wrong. My head is spinning and. Oh no! Oh no! It's 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 too late! It's too late! No, must be dreaming. Is it real? It can't be. Oh, that's creepy. The skull's heads follow you. It's like those weird paintings. Just keep moving. Where the hell am I? <laughs> Laura, Laura. Dad? No, it can't be. No, wait. I'm close now. I'm close now. I'm close now. Wait, where am I? How far does this path go? This path is It's not real. Not him. This path is confusing because. Dad, stop, please. What the? What the hell? No. Got to get out of here. I didn't think there'd be jump scares in Rise of the Tomb Raider. I just want to leave, please. No, no, this isn't. Why are you doing this? Stop! God damn you, stop! It's a 
Me, it is too late. 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 Oh, Dad, no. Don't do it, please. Someday. 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 You'll understand. You'll understand. You'll understand. You'll understand. Who are you? Come and see. What the hell was that? It was like a... A bull skull on top of a human body. What the hell? That's not possible. It's just a myth. I'm sorry, Laura. There is no return. You're going to rot out here. Dogonak mat kotakar. What the? What the hell are these? Oh, they're one shot kills at least. Oh my god, they're coming from multiple. Oh my! I thought they were just coming out of the one location. Holy crap. Oh, what the hell are these? They're like dogs without fur on their skull. No, this. Oh, God, don't. This can't. Come, your father awaits you. Not real. No. <laughs> Hallucinating. God, I hope I was. Hallucinating? There, <clears throat> there is a flower in a valley that can bring on visions, but the effects are too weak. Oh, Any so idea good. What this place is. I see ducks and pipes. Soviet from the looks of it. It has to be the outpost the Soviets built to study the ruins. My grandmother was a scholar, and they brought her here to help with her research, but. That was the last time Grandpa ever saw her. There was only one survivor, an officer, who stumbled out a few weeks later. He said the witch made them do things. By do things, you mean? But like I was gonna say, um... That, that uh, path was confusing because it... it, it you know, like behind you disappeared as you continued to walk. So it took you to weird... Odd locations. I never held my daughter. They took her from me on the surgeon's table. I tried to fight, but they are many, and I am weary. Then they dragged me away, split our three hearts apart. They have taken me to a hidden vale where ancient ruins stand. They tell me if I cooperate, I will see my family again. I will never trust these monsters, but I do not have a better plan. There are curious flowers here. Exposure to the pollen has left my captors rattled, and they will go no further than our little outpost. They brought me here in the hopes that my expertise in botany would help them find a counteragent. <laughs> At last, the state has a use for me. I nod and smile. I play the part. But they cannot break me again. For my daughter. For Ivan. I will live. All right, so that is the that is the girl's grandmother. Uh, you're led to us. I'm ninety percent sure, even though we don't. I did it tell us her grandfather's name. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm gonna assume that's the grandmother. It makes, you know, it makes the most logical sense. Those seem to be a little quiet. Um, I'll check the sound after I'm done recording this video on those and figure out if I need to turn the volume up or whatnot. Uh, the Someone's other one been in here recently building on top of the ruins what do you see some sort of makeshift distillery 
Smells just like the flowers. Shit! Of course! She's refining the pollen, weaponizing it. There's no magic here, Nadia, just someone very clever. Wait, but... If it is just a person, then wouldn't the pollen affect her too? If she can resist it somehow, then so can we. Hmm. I've got to bring it lower. Oh, okay, I get it. I thought I thought that opened it up. Okay. Move. Usually these things have a timer. Alright, that should do it. Um I keep losing my train of thought because there keeps being dialogue like every two seconds. Alright, are you gonna snap? There we go. Wait, what? Right, let me try this again. Maybe I need to manually cut it. I don't see why I would need to manually cut it, but... Okay, so it needs to... Oh, here we go. Whoa. That should be enough force. Just have to get the bucket closer. Okay. Okay, I got it. I didn't think you actually would use this, but you do. So... Wait till it's fully pulled. There we go! Alrighty! Is there gonna be some dialogue here? Because it seems like every time I go to say... See? I knew it! It's oh. been weeks since these bastards dragged me from the Gulag. From Ivan and my daughter. To this strange veil. They have tasked me with finding some way of counteracting the unusual effects of the pollen that hangs in the air. Now I believe I have a formula that may work. An extract from the seed pods of the plant. The liver of animals that consume the flowers and have metabolized the toxins. A phenothiazine derivative. The last ingredient is a risk. They have it in large quantities around the gulag, where it is used as an insecticide may also act as a rudimentary antipsychotic, bearing a chemical similarity to other compounds I have studied. Or it may be poisonous. I will try the mixture on myself tonight. Uh, that's a horrible idea. Why don't you ask the Soviets for one of their... I found something. One of the prisoners wrote down a formula that might counteract the effects of the pollen. It has to be for my grandmother. The witch killed her, and now she's going to help save Grandpa, just like in one of his stories. Uh, Nadia. Have faith, Lara. Hop back to the Soviet installation where we met. I'll help you find what you need. Oh, sweet. Where does this take me, though? I want to see where this takes me first. Oh! Oh, alright, that's pretty sweet. I'll grab that in a second. That was that wall I was looking at just earlier and said I didn't think I'd get the other side at this point in time. See. Nadia, my granddaughter, by now you already know, I am going into the Vale to kill the witch, Baba Yaga. I have gone to seek revenge for your grandmother. There are newcomers in our valley, armed men arriving in helicopters. I do not know what they want, but I know, if I am to go, this is my last chance. You deserve to know the truth, to know why. Your grandpa is not a wise man. I have become, with hard work, a good man for your grandmother's sake. But it was not always so. I came from the West, where even a small village has thousands of inhabitants. I was a lazy young man, and I dreamed of an easy life when I joined the party. A comfortable desk in the big city. But they sent me here, to the ends of the earth, to watch men and women work and starve and die to participate in their punishment. I knew it was evil, but I did not know how to fight until I met her. All right, so that's the grandfather. He, he wrote this for Nadia, but then he took it with him. Like an idiot. But... That is going to do it for the first episode of this Let's Play of the DLC. Um, I think this seems like a perfect time to uh, call it an episode 
and we'll pick it up next time going back to get the ingredients we need. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys then. Peace out.